In 2018 election rally in Karnataka, Prime Minister Narendra Modi had dubbed Congress leader Sidramaya's government here as Sidha Rupaya Sarkar or 10% Commission Sarkar. And now cut to five years later, BJP at the helm of affairs here with Chief Minister Baswaraj Bombay is facing similar charges of corruption. In fact, they have been called a 40% Commission Sarkar. And with that, it's indeed clear that corruption is a big crisis to fix in the state. Stacks of cash amounting to 6 crore rupees was found in the house of BJP MLA Madal Virupaksha's son. Karnataka government's corruption watchdog Lokayukta arrested Prasant Madal on 3rd March for accepting a bribe of 40 lakh rupees. A day before, he was caught red-handed receiving the bribe. MLA Virupaksha resigned as the Karnataka Soaps and Detergents Limited Chairman. He is accused of collecting bribes through his son from contractors supplying raw materials for KSDL. We have given Lokayakta all the powers which was taken away by Congress. Our intent is to weed out corruption. That's why we have given it and we are not in for the very fact that there was a raid on a, my MLA house by the Aloka Yakta, which we appointed. That shows that we are firm behind corruption. Let it be ruling party or opposition party. And we have given enough freedom to Aloka Yakta. Imagine this we could have done in Congress. It would never happen. That's the difference between Congress and us. MLA redundantly in his house more than eight crores money found. He was not arrested. Government is supporting uh, that MLA. Because of government and uh, because of government advocate, they got uh, interim bail. That's all. They got bail, temporary bail. Virupaksha is not the only one. In fact, the Basavaraj Bombay government has been accused of working on projects only when they received bribes from all quarters. In 2022 April, Linga Edsia alleged must pay 30% commission to get grants. Contractors Association alleged 40% commission is sought for tenders. They wrote to the Prime Minister for being harassed for commission. Today I have called a press conference. You have demanded from the government that to release 22,000 crores of pending amount. Yes, sir. We are telling. You please release the at a time and all the 22,000 crores. Okay. And otherwise you maintain the seniority. 7 to 10 percent they are asking. And that's why we are protesting on this one. One of the contractors, Santosh Patil, who raised graft allegations against Karnataka Minister K.S. Ishwarappa, was found dead in April last year. He wrote to Prime Minister Modi and Union Rural Development and Panchayat Raj Minister Giriraj Singh, naming K.S. Ishwarappa state RDPR minister and his associates harassing him for commission to clear bills. Corruption to an extent uh, uh, plays a role in the election. People get fed up with uh, you know, corruption charges uh, flying around. And uh, Congress very effectively used uh, uh, the contract association uh, allegation that you know, they had to pay 40% commission for everything. Even the education department has been charged with corrupt practices by 13,000 schools from Karnataka. They too wrote to the Prime Minister seeking intervention. Current BJP government in Karnataka is certainly on the back foot with the mounting corruption charges against them and the opposition is riding high on this to corner the Saffron Party.